another episode of Naomi the G. On today's episode, I am channeling you very beautiful Virgos, okay? So as I was getting into your energy, I definitely see the energy of someone that could have been going through a few things. Um, more like on the health realm, like maybe you haven't been feeling yourself lately. Maybe you have been feeling like kind of sick, maybe under the weather. Um, Spirit wants you to know that there is a new beginning, a new chapter. You're going to start feeling like yourself again. Um, and it's coming very, very soon. I feel like especially if you have been going through, um, even like on an emotional level, like mentally, um, if you've been going through a, a change of feeling like shy or anxious or just really not feeling in yourself in your emotional bag, you know what I'm saying? Like maybe you're feeling like, People been gaslighting you and you feel one way, but they've been telling you, oh no, girl, it's really this. I feel like a lot of the energy is changing for you. And I feel that way because this, of course, is new moon in Virgo. So this energy will probably be like this. If you've been feeling kind of low, it will be alle alleviated um, between now and tomorrow. Um, if you've been feeling like this over the last week or so. I feel like new energy is going to be blessed and given unto you. So just go ahead and take that with stride. It is your season, Virgo. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and pause with that. We're going to go ahead and get into your actual reading right now. So if you would be so kind to please hit subscribe on your way in. And thank you so much for doing so. Also, please like the video and let me know in the comments how this Virgo new moon is working for you. Now, let's get right into your reading. Like I said, obviously, I did see that you could be going through something like where you're feeling a little bit of that disappointment. Maybe you're just not feeling yourself these days. But things will eventually change. I also urge you to please make sure that you are giving grace to people as you want it to be given to you. Like, make sure you're being fair with people. You know, like, don't try to use your power and take advantage of people. And in the same breath, um, a lot of this energy is straightforward or it's split. So if somebody is doing this to you, making you feel like, you know, your thoughts are not right or what you're thinking about is not necessarily what it is, um, I'm urging you or spirit is urging you to don't let them play with your emotions like that. Um, if they're not being fair to you, let them fly like a bird in the sky. Just go ahead and start um, dissidence yourself from them, Virgo. And I feel like a lot of this stuff is happening to you um, for a reason. It's just really just bringing you back to self. Ooh, what is going on with y'all? I hate seeing these reversals. Well, 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 Virgo. I feel like right now it's like a, it's a kind of energy of someone going through things, um, internally like not being on time you know i'm waking up late and just being like fuck it i'm gonna just today's gonna be one of them days where i just don't feel like being anywhere on time i feel like it's a self um self image kind of thing like when you this is how you're viewing yourself virgo you are in a moment where you are just in a funk and it will change everything is going to work out for you baby and it's going to work out for you very very soon um there's going to be other opportunities things coming towards you um and it's going to happen all of a sudden you just got to really kind of maintain this balance of life i feel like you could be out of balance right now and you could be probably going through a moment where you know what i'm saying you know how you just have bad hair days <laughs> if that's the thing for you, Virgo, if you're going through that, or you might just be having a bad day, like, you know, maybe you're having, like, self, negative self-talk, and you're not even, it's like a body image kind of thing, where you kind of, like, are neglecting yourself, or you feel like you've been neglecting yourself, and you just ain't feeling it, you know what I'm saying? So, if this is the energy that you've been in, we're going to blame it on the moon, and this is the one time I'm going to do that, because I don't blame nothing on the moon, but the energy of the moon is, um... It's dark right now. It's in, it's in an energy of where new moons are dark. Okay, not saying evil, bad, good, none of that. The new moon, the energy of this new moon, especially if being in Virgo, you just got to keep in mind that things are just going to start like that. Um, going, You got to probably get to yourself and kind of learn how to deal with what's going on around you. I feel like it's a mental struggle, tug of war kind of situation. And just continue to talk yourself out of it. You're going to be fine. And if you can't, 
talk yourself out of it you might consider going to talk to somebody okay and let them know like i'm just having these very crazy thoughts about myself right now i don't feel like people are understanding me as they should you know what i'm saying but that also goes back to you like the energy that you're projecting out are you understanding yourself are you understanding the changes that you're going through you might be going through body changes that you know you have no control over because you probably just had a baby or age is starting to get the best of you it could be a number or a number of different things and honestly um spirit just wants you to know that you got to amp up your self-talk you know what i'm saying like really get to yourself and start trying to handle stuff like if you feel like every time you get somewhere you're feeling anxious Maybe you should start trying to be on time, baby. Okay, practice on being on time. I feel like that whole not being on time is definitely affecting the way you, you're speaking to yourself. Um, if time is one of those things, like if you're feeling like you're not knocking out your goals as you're supposed to, get back into self. Like, what, are, what goals am I trying to accomplish here? What is the, why am I even going this hard, okay? What was the reason why I decided to get into X, Y, Z? And I just feel like you're probably going through a situation where you're needing to ask yourself a lot of questions. Um, but will things work out for you? Yes. Will you get out of this funk? Yes. Is it um, going to take some time? No. <laughs> exactly. It's not going to take its time coming to you. This energy will come and go. Okay. And people, and we all, and anybody that's watching this, if you're Virgo or not, we all go through this you know what i'm saying we all go through tough times in our life or even in our mental in our mind where we just think that we're just we're always anxious and thinking that things ain't gonna work out right now things might not be coming into completion for you or might not be working out like the way you think they should but spirit wants you to know once you take a good rest a good nap great self-talk maybe eat some good food maybe be around some good people and for some maybe you should get alone and just enjoy your own company and get into your own thoughts and then prioritize yourself first make sure you're getting places on time this is the energy of the virgo new moon of organization it's time for you to organize your life accordingly like this is the time for you to go ahead and start getting some things done for yourself because the world needs you virgo what would we, we, we be without an analytical Virgo t telling us every move we should be making at every cost? And the reason why, because y'all research everything, y'all study everything to the T. We need y'all. Okay, so we need you, Virgo, to get back into yourself, get back and tap into your energy because it's much needed in the world. And if ain't nobody ever told you that, I'm telling you right now, we do need you. Okay, come back to us, girl. Until next time, you guys, please make sure that you hit subscribe. Also, like the video if you like the video and also comment below how this new moon in Virgo is tripping you out, okay? Let me know and I'll talk to you very soon. Mwah!